Hello friends, welcome back to the new tutorial of the Node.js. Today we are going to learn about the MongoDB Atlas connection using the Node.js. So let's see how we are going to do that. Before, those who haven't subscribed my channel yet, please do subscribe my channel. And if you like the video, please do like, share and comment on my video. So let's get started. So here we have to log in with first the MongoDB Atlas. First of all, we have to register that part. So I'm going to log in with the Google. So select any of the account. I accept. Submit. So select any what is the goal of that one why we're building. Uh, so here we can select any of the things. Bylab or what preferred language that is JavaScript. Finish. So here we have the provider AWS. So select <coughs> depends upon to you like which one package you want to select. Okay, so here we have the 0.08 or you can go with the for learning and exploring MongoDB in the client environment. You can also select this one. Okay, and cluster and here we have a cluster. So whatever you want to name where we have the origin you can select the origin from here so i think india part is there there is mumbai part so select this one and we are selecting the free create one okay so let's move to the next create so username magento developer we are saying and this is our password so let's copy this password and add it over here okay create user so currently our okay so we have to uh, next we have the this is our username so make sure you have to copy this one right okay so where you would like to connect from uh, enable SS from any network that you need to read and write the script. So it the, the, from my local local network or the cloud, you have to select which one. Okay. So use the configuration network access between that last of a computer premise, especially set up IP address list. So my local environment I'm setting up. Okay. So I can add my IP, add my current IP address. Okay. So IP, this IP address has been added. So 
so why do they have added my IP address okay this is the IP that is coming up so here they have added finish and close go and overview so we get the configuration so we have a node share starter so here we have an app.js file that may we may have the connection we don't require currently resources for the, this is resource center okay app services we we need uh, now we are going to need the connection string They, they are just loading We have to check the data services. Connect. So here we have a set up the connection string and all. So we have modified visiting the GUI. So here we have the string. So we need to add this copy this string. Okay. View and there you have the view full code also. So you can also use the full code part also. Okay, MongoDB client if you require MongoDB. So this is connection string which I'm, I am I required this one. Okay, so just copy this one and I will need to just pass it over here the connection string. Right. So it's to be URL. Okay, you get this string. Right. And here we have to add the password. So this is the password that we have already. So we will add this password over here. And try to run this one okay so let's copy this and open any node.js project where is node.js so any of the project let's take in this example so where we have the this is controller where we have we'll create a new file server.js 
right and we will add the code over here this is the connection string which we are getting from the mongodb at last okay so now we are going to require the mongoose so let's install the mongoose over here npm i mongoose okay so install this package Now we have to add node server.js for the database connection setup. Error connect to the database option use create index is not supported. Okay, so we don't require the use create index over here. Just remove it, save it, and run it again. Authentication bad auth. Bad auth means might be the password issue, this one. Okay. Save this and run it again. See, connected to the database, right? So we are successfully connected to the database with the help of the MongoDB at last. Any doubt, any query in that, do let me know in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching this video. Have a great day.